uh, I expect that sometime in June, uh, uh, the special prosecutor, Ambassador Clint Williamson, our former ambassador at large for war crimes, uh, will, at that point, uh, uh, I, I don't know exactly what he'll do, but they'll be providing some information about the results of that investigation by June. And it's very important that before that time, Kosovo sends a signal that it's prepared to stand up to, uh, to deal with these charges which have been a black cloud over Kosovo for some number of years in a way that's uh, fully transparent and has international credibility. Uh, what this is really about is Kosovo's credibility. And by establishing a, a special court, a special Kosovo court, to be staffed by international judges, uh, with a seat in Kosovo, but also with a seat outside of Kosovo, where sensitive matters uh, such as interviews with witnesses can be dealt with. Uh, that would mean that Kosovo was stepping up uh, to its international responsibilities and, and building its international credibility. Uh, I think it's uh, a challenging task. Uh, right now, anything that requires uh, two-thirds of, of the parliament to vote in favor of it is, uh, is a challenge. Uh, but this is, I think, one of the most important things, certainly during my time here, that we've uh, ever asked Kosovo to do. Well,